Hey, what's up, guys? In this video, we're going to finishing Act 5. Okay, this is the final path. We're on 5.3.6. We finished um, after the 5.4 stream. I did a few weeks ago. I was slowly doing 5.1, and then I slowly did 5.2. 5.2 had some annoying um, fights. Um, the collector was pretty bad, but and we got to 5.3. And all I'm going to say is, after doing 5.3, I've considered myself pretty much a guillotine 2099 master. There's a few paths. There's two paths I can think of in particular. The skill one, and then the first mystic one, where the first fight on the path was a Dormammu with, like, um, with, I don't know what that node's called. The one that if you put a debuff, they gain more power gain. I forgot what it's called. I don't know how I forgot, but it's, like, everywhere uh, in Act 5, but, um... Basically, guillotine de degenerates don't count for it, but he was the first fight in the quest, so I didn't have it ramped up, but, like, I mastered the art of fighting Dormammu. Like, if you guys, um, are curious, um, I could make a video on how to fight Dormammu, like, with, like, not even, like, the best characters, because there's, like, ways you can do it and, like, play really fucking well without, like, really ever, um, uh, what's it called, activating the degen. So if you guys want to see that, just let me know. Um... But yeah, this is the final path in Act 5.3. I thought I'd show just a little bit of it. I'm doing it right now as we speak. This isn't like a voiceover. Like, I'm actually doing the quest right now. Like, I just killed Daredevil. So yeah, we, um, we're not going to be able to open that much today. But I just thought I'd show you, like, finishing Act 5. I think we can open some, like, rank-up gem crystals and a 5-star working gem. We're also going to get a 5-star generic. What I'm looking for the most is, um, by far... Um, science for the Awakening Gem. I have a generic at the end of Act 5, which I'm going to give to Void if I don't get a science here today, which I'm fine with, because I have pretty much every other class except for science as, like, an, a, just a, a normal Awakening Gem, like a class one. So, yeah, um, that's pretty much what I'm planning on doing. I want to build my combo shield in this fight, but his Furies are kind of annoying, so i got to be a little careful for that. Also, my voice might sound a little bit dead. That's just because, like, I woke up, like, 15 minutes ago. So, yeah. That's the reason it sounds like that. Alright. Okay, that was very scuffed, but I'll take it. Okay, we got all our combo shields up, so I feel a lot better about this fight. Yeah, let's go. Come on. We're gonna get some six star shards also, but like not nearly enough to open a crystal because we like just opened a six star like a few weeks ago and um, We got that Proxima Midnight. I know some of you guys in my stream were saying Proxima is just decent She's not like super good not super bad, but uh, like for this type of content, bro She was and she was one of the MVPs. So I am very very happy. I got Proxima. She's just so good just like these like 5.3 fights, just 5.2, anything that's annoying, you just get like one special, two or special three and everything's just dead. It's so beautiful. Um, in 5.3, she's doing, when I have two of my three charges done, because I normally, I normally get to a special three, like a little bit before I get my second prompt done. Um, and normally it does 50,000 damage if it doesn't kill. That's with the attack reduction. So normally it would be done 100,000 damage. And that's only with two of my um, prompts completed. So with all three of them, I should be maybe doing like, well, like 140, 150, 160, somewhere around that ballpark. So like she's not good for, she's not super good for Act 6 also. Just being able to just drop like 150k special threes like they're nothing. And she's only at rank 1. If I take her to rank 2, she's going to be a monster, dude. I don't even know. If there was no attack, um, if there was no, what's it called? Health pool cap how damage cap and labyrinth or abyss i could just take them there and just like destroy every fight but there is so it's kind of annoying if there's no damage cap could you just imagine how beautiful that would be so yeah okay we're on this black widow i think we have what one more fight after this black widow on the path and then we have like the final path like the final like few champions before the boss so that's nice we're almost there guys it's taken a lot of energy refills to get here like, you see my units, I have, like, 300 units. Uh, like, majority of the units I've bought have not been for revives. They've been for refills, because I've just been trying to get through this as fast as possible. Um, so, yeah, like, I've spent, like, at least, like, seven, 800 units on just refills, just spam going through everything. 
So yeah, it's a, it's definitely a it's definitely you gotta go through Act Five. Like it's slow. It's not like a fast process. I was thinking about it. I don't think I'm really ever gonna explore Act Four in this account. Like Act Four, I think is longer than Act Five, and the, the, I'm not gonna spend energy refills on Act Four just because like. I don't, the rewards aren't good enough. I was only doing it for this because the rewards are good and I want them. So if I were to go through Act 5, uh, I mean Act 4, like two paths a day with like the energy in the morning and the energy at night, whatever, like it would take like years for me to actually finish it. So I don't think that content's ever going to get done, but whatever, dude. Okay, let's throw a special too. I don't know if this is too much damage, but we also want to be careful that we don't activate or regenerate because this heal reversal in this quest, which is kind of annoying. I mean, it's on like a timer. I haven't even triggered it yet in this quest, as far as I remember. Because I did like most of this path last night, and then I went to bed once I ran out of energy, and I was going to do the rest of this like today. Um, we got to watch out. If we take another special one, it's going to trigger right. Okay, no, we're good. I want to trigger it right now. Okay, we triggered it. That's good. All right, we're back at 50% health. Okay. This is the best I've probably had in this quest. This quest has been pretty... This quest wasn't that bad except for the um, the 50% power gain part because there was this Hyperion and he was just not good. Like, the noted corner. That's what I was thinking of. He gets cornered. He's cornered and power reserve. So Symbiote Supreme wasn't really the best. It was just a not fun fight. But we got through it nonetheless. So it's fun. We're at the final, like, three fights now, I think. Like Iceman, Dr. Octopus, and then Green Goblin. So, yeah. Let's go in this. Let's do it. Guillotine 2099. I would probably say the... I don't know, actually. I think the MVP is either between Proxima or Guillotine. Um, Archangel, I used him for a lot of random Electros that they just threw around... <laughs> There's a lot of just like electros they just like to sprinkle around Act Five. I noticed, um, five point three in particular. They were just everywhere, dude. Um, what else? I'm trying to think. Who else was an MVP character? Catch him of a movie was like borderline useless because like with their fifty percent reduction. Just being able to not kill the fights fast, it was just a pain to keep the binaries up, considering I don't have Nick Fury synergy, so I, I literally took her out of the team, as you might have seen, So which makes me a little bit concerned for Act 6, like, I don't know if I want to rank her up after what I saw there, uh, but I don't know, dude, she just did not seem good without Nick Fury, which I know make, like, I know there's a big argument for Corvus versus Captain Marvel movie. But the more I actually play the game, I think most people come to the realization that Camera Robot movie is definitely just not better than Corvus. But whatever. I hope maybe at a higher rank she'll perform better, but at rank 3 it was mm, not good. Like, Sunspot is also rank 3, and he was doing it way better. Or, I guess he's rank 5 as a 4-star, but that's like the same power level, so you know what I mean. Alright, we got to do that fight cleanly, which is like a first. I think I've died with my guillotine in that fight every time. Um, and I've had to use, use Ghost. I brought Ghost in the team. Only, only for this fight. Ghost was not really being used anywhere else in Act 5. My main team normally uh, was Guillotine, Proxima, Sunspot, Symbiote Supreme, and Cat Marvel Movie. I took out Cat Marvel Movie, as you know, like I just said. But, yeah, those five were really... Cat Marvel Movie was good, though, for, like, um... Not 5.3. 5.2, 5.1, is good for. But the second it was those health pools, it was just bad. Oh, yeah, there's no regeneration in this fight. I think this guy has, like, a node that's just, like, we can't activate regeneration. So that's why our region didn't activate, in case you're wondering. Also, can this guy throw a special, please? Bro. Uh, I don't like Dr. Octopus. Okay. Let's go, bro. I don't know if we're going to have enough... I think we're going to have a little bit too much damage. We might not be able to get to a special 3. So we might have to lift some heavies. This guy is not cooperating though. Which is kind of annoying. Yeah, we're really not getting that much power. Let me throw some heavies. Because you're doing so much damage to this man. I 
Okay, we did it. Cool. Yeah, we got one fight, guys. One fight left. We're 10 minutes into the recording, so not the longest path. I mean, I cut out, like, 60% of it, so you're welcome for that. But this is the final fight in Act 5, guys. We are at the final fight of Act 5, okay? Final fight. Let me just make sure I'm recording. Okay, cool. Um, I'll use Proxima. Proxima is not the best I found for Act 5. Just for, like, the only reason I say that is because the Act 5 AI is very passive sometimes. So when I get the intercept one, it is pretty painful at times. Sometimes I can just get four backdrafts in a row. And then sometimes they just, like, light intercept me because they're just standing there. It's pretty scuffed, but they're not the most predictable AI. Like, Act 6 AI is very predictable what they're going to do. These guys are definitely not predictable in, like, any way. Like a month. He's also not the best for Green Goblin, I just realized, because of his power reduction. Pretty much if I get to a special 3, he dies, but getting to a special 3 is a little bit difficult with all of his power um, reduction. In case you're wondering, um, the green thing is give him, give him more power gain, and I think you power reduction. Okay, he's not coming at me. And then the red one just gives him healing, I think. But like, we've done 15 hits, so we're like barely over a special one, so. Come on, bro. Come on. Wow, that was like the first time in like forever I didn't get slapped while trying to go for intercepts. Normally, I just get, like, light intercepted or some dumb shit. It's really fun. All right, let's throw some heavies now. Dude, that power gain is so strong. Jesus Christ. Come on. He's getting, like, one bar power for every heavy. That's pretty sad. Come on, bro. Uh, this is also, like, the best I've dodged... I mean, I can normally dodge Green Goblin special too, but you know, sometimes you get those off days and you just get slapped. So I'm so close to ending this fight. Please don't choke at the end. Okay. I also have this like purple safeguard thing whenever I block energy attacks with Proxima. I really don't know what the hell it is, but whatever. Okay, let's get to special three, please. All right, we got there, guys. Act five is done. I can raise my hands to the sky. Oh, so beautiful. I never have to go into X5 again. Thank God. I could have maybe ended that with a special two, but whatever. I wanted to do it for cinematic reasons, special three. Um, so yeah, guys, X5 is done. Um, hopefully. I didn't, like, f forget a quest or something. Six units, pretty nice. Chapter Exploration Awards. Okay, nice. And then we get the Act Exploration Awards. Okay, this is nice. So, what is this? Elder. We can rank four a character. Hopefully, we get like science. And then, hopefully, we get like science from this too. We get like all science. We also have a four to five for the four star. So, I think cosmic is the best just because. Um, I think cosmic's the best just because we can rank five Corvus because I use him in AQ a lot. So, yeah. Let's see what we have. So, we have the Wigan Gem, the two to three. Than these okay, so let's open the four star four to five. Let's just pop it. Cosmic science that's not gonna get used, I don't think. Um, but whatever, it might have used. Let's do the two to three. Um, for this, we really just want science, honestly. We just as much science as we can get today, like anything that science is good. Um, it'll help us rank up our void. Oh, fuck. skill. Do we have any skill characters? I don't think we have anyone to rank up. I mean, it'll have a use eventually, but for right now, it's kind of useless. And this is the big boy. Let's get let's let's get science in both of the th the these last two crystals. We get science in both these really six. If we get cosmic here, that wouldn't be that bad either. If we come over movie, um, anything but mystic really. Tech? Do we have any tech characters? We have Stark Spider Man. Maybe I rank him up. I don't know. Not the worst, but not really the best either. But this one, please. Um, I have four classes with an Awakening Gems right now, and Science is not one of them. So we have, we do not have Cosmic, but we don't really need Cosmic. We have Tech, we have Mune, we have Skill, we have Mystic. We do not want Cosmic, because that's pretty fucking useless. But we want Science, okay? The one class that we don't have that's actually useful, okay? Please, Science. If we can get just one thing I want today, that'd be really sexy. 
If not, it's kind of expected, but please, science. I'm going to tap it. Please, science. Please, science. Please, science. All right, now we have two skill ones. Ugh, fuck, dude. Skill classes. I've had, this is the same problem I have, my, I have my main account. Too many skill awakening gems. So, let's just look what we got. So, for rank up gems, we got skill. So, we got a two to three skill. So, maybe if we get like a good skill one day, we can awaken him. We have two awakening gems for science. I might awaken him. We could also awaken Stark Spidey and take him up. Um, but the main thing is we got the awakening gem for Void. We got really unlucky. We didn't get like any rank up gems for him. Any awakening gems. Anything. But the main thing is now, the main team I think we're going with in Act 6 now, we're going to take Symbio Supreme, Proxima, we're going to rank 4 Camera for Movie before we go in, we're going to rank 4 Void before we go in, so that's 4 people already, and then it could be Gwenpool, Starkey, I don't know who the 5th is going to be yet, but we already have a really solid 4 that could carry, so I'm pretty excited, um, we finished, I'm, how many 6 star shards we have right now, I'm just curious. We are not close. Okay, that like we had five hundred before that. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. We literally are done with X five. It's very beautiful. We can awaken our void now. It took a lot of energy refills, but we eventually did it. So yeah, X five is a hundred percent. Pretty nice. Pretty nice indeed. Let me just look back at my rank of gems just to see what I'm working with exactly. Um rank of gems for all these things okay we can take a skill the two to three um i don't know that's gonna be useful we can take stark spidey to rank four probably gonna take stark spidey as our fifth character just because we have this and we have a four to five for science i love how the one science thing we got is something we can't really use for our five star void so let's do our four star science yeah this is never gonna get used okay that thing's gonna rot for eternity i hope you guys enjoyed this video like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one peace